all, welcome to this video where today we will talk about consumer the king. In the era when we talk about various accomplishments of different organizations, are we really talking about the efficient marketing and sales techniques or is it the customer's buying strength we are talking about? Every country has a special set of market in which every organization is keen to penetrate to exploit the fruitful results of purchasing power of the consumers of that country. Here in this video, we are trying to look into the various aspects of business and the relation of the business with the customer. Let us start with the major question when it comes to business-customer relationship. Are business and customer independent or business thrives only in existence of a good consumer market? As it is said that it's not only a good devotee who requires God, it is God who also requires a good devotee to be complete. Will this analogy go same for the same customer relationship? We have seen countries like US with a wide customer segment and good purchasing power come to point where China became one of the major suppliers of various consumer goods like shoes and clothing. We have seen Japan manufacturing electronics that are worldwide items and were used as a necessity in almost every household and also some of the items that became raw material for many of the businesses. We have also seen countries like India where a big community of local businesses we are ready to be explored till the start of early 19th century. A business is always in need of a better market where all those products can be utilized in volume and there is always a segment ready with cash in hand in need of better products. Yes, obviously the customer will have an edge above business because a business thrives only when he has a good consumer market. There is a very famous quote by American businessman, entrepreneur and author Sam Walton and really fits into each and every conversation about customer and business relationship. There is only one boss, the customer, and he can fire everybody in company from the chairman on down simply by spending his money somewhere else. It is very important for every business to keep in view the importance of customer, otherwise it could be fatal. Though there would be products which every household would be requiring, but still the market is in full competition and we cannot ignore that every company is in a hurry to introduce a product which is best than the rest to thrive and win. Customer is the ultimate king. It's not because he is the one who needs a developed lifestyle and an easy life. It's because it will be the customer's hand that will be picking up your product from basket of same alternatives and making you earn. 